Oops. So I have up here this Desmos screen that has a lot of what people are saying, and it's all really great stuff. I want to find a way later to, to like share this and, and make it out, uh, make it sort of public so it's existing alongside the other things. And I know you guys are, are having conversations about uh, a pretty tough concept of sort of like, you know, how do we open this up for, for new people? So certainly, you know, don't stop just to listen to me. Uh, well, I mean, do stop so I can talk, but you can talk after this. You can talk at home, you know, whatever. We're all on Twitter, right? Anyways, I, so I, I'm gonna interrupt the, this little part of the story here, and I'm gonna talk about uh, myself, because that's an important part, is to make it about myself. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Okay, actually, maybe talk about yourselves for like 20 seconds. I decided I was going to do it, so I made this choice. All right, I'm going to do that. 
And then I actually started doing it. I got on WordPress, I, uh, I, I made a website, I with some other people, so me and the Coast to Coast people, we started doing that, we're on Twitter a lot, things happen. Um, on Twitter, I, I felt confident enough later on to like actually answer questions, and then I, I, I eventually went on to like start some initiatives, and some things like that, where I'm like tweeting and talking to people. So, this I feel like is, is this transition that I, I had, where, where I went from not, from the non-TBOS, to like the people that are sort of in the, the push center, the mid boss or the whatever. So, along this uh, trajectory, I was wondering at what point would you co consider me to have joined the mid boss? So that was my question. So I kind of thought one way to do that would be, I'll just, I'll walk, I'll start here and I'll walk over there, and then you guys could like clap at the point at which you think I've, I've sort of made it, I'm in there, and then we could keep clapping, and I get an idea of like where it would work. Or what, at what point would it be like, all right, I'm in, it starts. That that makes sense? Okay, so right now I'm over here, nobody should be clapping, because it's, I'm obviously not doing anything. I'm off the screen. <laughs> this, is, this is me, I'm in high school playing video games. Like, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Justin. It's great. Okay, so now I'm gonna start walking. I'll start walking. Can you guys, think? All right, now I'm here. I'm here. Yeah. This is great. This is a great way to like work out Okay, so the there isn't really a point to this. Um, <laughs> Because there's no real answer, right? It's it's really hard. It's really hard to for other people to tell somebody else when you have or haven't done it. I think it's up to me, and I feel like I didn't really get it till I was here. And I that's that one's like it's, it's totally in my head. But I don't think I would have got here if it wasn't for real people. I think actually talking to someone and seeing like seeing real people and seeing like their their it's understanding that like there's these real actual people was was probably the biggest turning point for me personally. And if I was gonna do anything with this like little platform that I had, I, I think it would be to try and encourage all of us to look for more ways to get real people to connect. I was lucky that I had, you know, I was in these organizations that could fly into these conferences where I could like meet people and I know it's not the case for everybody. I know that means that some of these these things don't need to happen online. Um, that's why I'm super excited about the kind of like initiative situations, like uh, what Explore Boss did for so many people right in the initial offgoing, and what the, the different things that are going on now, like, I don't know, maybe the Math Photo 17 that we're trying to run has, has got somebody off the fence. Uh, so, so yeah, I, I think that's, that might be sort of my, my last thing is, is what are the kind of initiatives that, that we could create in order to reduce the amount of, oh, hold on, one more, one more thing I forgot to mention. Right, okay, so as, if you talk about me walking down this, this road and you talk about the vulnerability that Graham mentioned yesterday, as I go from here to there, I'm doing two things. One, I'm making myself more vulnerable because I'm opening myself out to, to more potential people, more, more criticism potentially, or whatever, all the negative things could happen. And at the same time that I'm doing that, something is, is telling me that like, actually, you're not vulnerable. So like, the amount of vulnerability that I feel at the moment is actually getting like, lower and lower because I actually feel, hell, oh, the, the Elliot Drago Severson's book about lean adult learning talks about a, a holding environment for teachers, and that the growth is really not going to happen unless you feel really like held, like comfortable, like a little kitten in a, in a hand. This would have been a good place. A picture that like I'm, there's enough on the internet that I don't need to put it on the screen. So a <laughs> little a little kitten cuddling up. That's what we want to. That's the kind of environment that that makes someone go from here to over there, and that's the kind of thing that maybe we can create, and we we have successfully. Otherwise, we wouldn't be here. So what are, what are other initiatives that we could create in order to help reduce the vulnerability and build connections for, for new teachers, for, for new members of whatever hashtag we want to call this thing. So, 
if you could, you could share it with a neighbor, you could tweet it out, and you can do this like right now, and you can also do this whenever. Like I said, I was going to put this up online, and, and the idea is for this to hopefully start like a larger conversation, um, and then to have as much of that and, uh, be captured later and to be you know used for something. So, so that's that's sort of the, the thing that I'm hoping. Um, I want to give you guys time to talk, and I also want to give you guys time to go to your sessions. So I feel like that's going to be all I want to say today. And thank you guys.